morning, virtual learners. For um, today, Wednesday, we are starting with lesson number 69 in our morning work. So number one says to write the sum of 5 plus 8. What is 5 plus 8? Question Brown. 13. 13. Good. Number two says the number 63 has how many tens and how many ones? Logan. Six tens and three ones. Good. That we should know because we've been doing that in math. Number three, you just have to draw a rectangle. So we're just going to draw a rectangle. Number four says to subtract 11 minus 3. Gwen? Eight. Good. Number five, write the time. Mason? Three o'clock. Good. Number six, what numbers come next? Caitlin? 86 and 87. Good. Number seven, you just have to write a plus sign. Looks like that. Number eight says to write a number sentence. There were 12 horses. Four horses ran away. How many horses were left? Parker? 12 minus 4. Good. 12 minus 4 equals 8. Good. So this one looks a little bit different than normal. It's got that like circle in there where you put your minus sign, but it's 12 minus 4 equals 8. Good. Number 9. Count by tens. Jordan. Good. So we are missing 70. And 90. Number 10, write another sentence for 5 plus 4 equals 9. Hello? 4 plus 5 equals 9. Good job. Good. All right. That one we can set to the side. And let's go on to phonics. All right, and virtual learners in phonics, today we are just writing. I had um, your friends in class just write go, me, and hi, because those are long vowel sounds. So all you have to do is write those words and then just write the word one more time on the line. So just gonna go, me, and hi. And then we just crossed out this part on the bottom. So for one, two, and three at the top, that's all you have to write. Is anyone still filling that in? Okay, I'll give you a minute. All right, so on the next page, just like normal, we write our spelling word. So word number one is what? Hey, good. What's number two? Make. Make, good. What's number three? Brave. Brave. Number four. Late. Okay. So yes. What's number five? Gave. Good. What's number six? Shape. Good. And number seven? Waves. Then the next one, Chase. What's after that? Baby. And number 10, Bake. And what's the bonus? January. Good. Don't forget to write a capital J. Good job. All right, if you're not done writing those, they are up on the board over there for you in the classroom. All right, so that's all we have for, for, for phonics today. Tomorrow we will read the little book, the Carol's little book. And then let's go on to handwriting. And in handwriting, I think we are on the letter S. 
today. So we have uppercase and lowercase s. So for the uppercase s, we are going to curve left, curve down, curve left. Curve left, curve down, curve left. Curve left, down, curve left. Okay. And trace or write those ones and then trace the ones on the next line. And do it on S's. All the way to the end. And then you're going to trace and write the words Sunday, Simon, and Samuel. And then you're also going to write the sentence, Sunday is the Sabbath. Yes. Simon? Cool. That's cool. I like that one. Like, almost like Simon says. That's what I think of. So Sunday two times. And Simon two times. And Samuel two times. And write the sentence. And then for the little s, you make it the same way, but it's just smaller and it starts at the midline instead of at the top. So curve left, curve down, curve left. It's just a miniature. Oh, look, this S. Okay, do the same thing. And then you're going to write the words Saints, Song, Sister, and Soul. Did anyone see the movie Soul over break? Yeah. That was good. We watched it too. It was good. It was really good. We liked it. I know. Yeah, we did too. Did you? <laughs> All right. And then the last sentence, you're just going to write, Jesus Christ saves us from sin. Okay. And then virtual learners, that's all that we have for handwriting today. And we will see you guys later. Bye.